13 ABC First Warning Weather with Chief Meteorologist Jay Bershback. Well, with all this talk of record cold and wind chills and wind and chill advisories and snow and stuff like that, let's take a break. How about this? Some words to warm you up tonight. Three thoughts for you. One, the days are getting longer. We gain almost one minute of daylight each day for the next week or two. It becomes two minutes, then three minutes as we get into more spring-like and summer-like weather. And have you ever seen this word before? Perihelion. What does that mean? I think I'll tell you. Yes, it means that we were the closest to the sun we'll get all year long today. I know it's so cold out there, hard to believe, but because our orbit around the sun's an ellipse, not a circle, today we were actually closer to the sun than we'll be in July. Did you feel it? Okay, third thing here, spring, just 75 days away. Right around the corner, right? It'll be here before you know it, and spring begins this year, March 20th, just after midday. So again, I know it's been cold, even colder the next several days, so... Think of the days getting longer. We're closer to the sun than we will be in the summer, and spring is right around the corner. I'm trying. All right, as far as the flurries out there, they're now wrapping up on Doppler radar. Had a quick dusting, so watch those road conditions as you wake up, and also prepare to just brush off the car or truck as you wake up. Watching the clouds peel away as we thought. Look at all the clearing here in mid-Michigan. As that moves our way tonight, it's going to open that freezer door and allow temperatures to plummet. Right now, it's not that bad out there. We're in the teens, but once that clearing works in, that temperature is going to drop quickly. So far, the low today, one below. It's the forecast for tonight. The high was 16, and you melt down the snow today, you get one hundredth of an inch of liquid equivalent. It's about one tenth of an inch of snow. How about temperatures around us tonight? 16 still. We've been there since the evening newscast. So with the clouds, got the comforter on. But again, it's about to get peeled away. West winds are at 9, wind chill at 4. Temps around us still in the teens, 12 in Hillsdale. And wind chill still positive, above zero. But watch what happens on Predictor for tonight. These numbers start to fall as we wake up. They're a little improved from earlier thinking by about 3, 4 degrees. But still around 10 below zero Thursday morning throughout the day. 5 to 10 below zero. We get even colder into Friday. This will be the coldest morning of the work and school week. 15, 20 below zero for wind chills. This is 8 a.m. Friday and then slowly improving throughout the day back between zero and 10 below zero. So tonight, one below zero. That's the air temperature. Wind chills well, closer to 10 below. A few spots may come close to 15, 20, but a little on the left edge of that range. For tomorrow, the hour cast. Look at this second batch of cold air. That's your high, seven degrees. Wind chills listed in the blue. It will be a dry day, but a little breezier than today. West winds kick back up 10 to 20 miles per hour, so blustery stuff. Friday's high temperature is five, Saturday's high five. Notice our lows for the next four nights below zero with the core of that Arctic air early Saturday, maybe a record low of 12 below zero. Good news though, we have some warmer air for folks that are just kind of tired of this stuff. Sunday's high near 30. We have light snow developing throughout the day into early Monday with one to two inches of accumulation. Above freezing Monday, 34, and we're back in the 20s, Tuesday and Wednesday, so uh, one day above freezing. Yeah, hang in there, folks. We're going to yeah. make it through. All right, <laughs> cool. Jay, thanks. Still to come on Action News tonight, a new wave of controversy swirling in the White House. We'll take you to Washington. And dollar menu mania, new options for fast food for the consumer. First, a look at tonight's winning lottery numbers from your official lottery station, 13ABC. Good luck.